Hello everybody, I'm in the letter word, all said in a smart and welcome back to the escape here inside of Santa's sweatshop. <laughs> I, uh, I don't have any face cam today, much like the previous episodes. I am better again. I have a little bit of a cough every so often. But uh, I'm currently looking for a new camcorder. So if you have suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. And you might notice that we are back to day six inside of this prison. Uh, that's because basically I had a backup of day four. And I basically played through everything that I did again. But things have gone a little bit differently this time around. Uh, so you'll notice that in my inventory, I saw this. I had to grab it just because I thought it was interesting. I got a mince pie. But it only restores five fatigue, which is kind of crap considering that cooked food is 10 and chocolate bars are 15 so it's not the best so I might just eat it now just to sort of get it out of the way but at least you know that exists um, so we're going to do the same thing as before but now I actually have a fake fence which is really really good so during the course of the day today I'm going to go in and I'm going to chop through that wall from the other side like I did before um, and then I think I'm just going to do a few jobs which will be quite good and people have already told me it's a little bit of a spoiler I, I admit I was a little bit annoyed to have found now but apparently after I put the lights on the tree I have to put press under the tree so uh, there's apparently another treasure chest or another like Christmas tree chest somewhere around this prison so I've obviously got to track that down locate it figure out you know what I need to combine with it in order to make these presents I'm going to assume it will be maybe you get like wrapping paper and then you have to get duct tape and then maybe it's going to be like one other item or maybe you could put any item inside of a present that'd be quite cool obviously you wouldn't be able to open it again but just in terms of making a uh, like a christmas present i could put like say a fork in there i could put a knife in there it could be absolutely anything um i think if i remember correctly i'm actually getting checked this morning so it's a good thing that i came back here because oh no 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 oh i'm not ready i'm not ready not ready now you can Oh, <laughs> that was close. I wasn't even thinking about me getting checked. I honestly blanked on that, like, that whole topic, and that was it. Good Lord. That was very, very close. You almost had me, Owen. You almost had me. Uh, right, I tell you, what, I'm going to chill out over here because the guards don't usually see me there. And then I'm going to hop over the, the little banner or the little bar, should I say. And we're going to get cracking. It's going to be good. Uh, there's only 6% left on that wall, which is all groovy. There you go, another 2%. The thing I like about this is I don't think anybody ever comes this far through. So I don't think anybody will ever actually see it, which is quite nice. Now, one thing that I don't have yet in comparison to where I was last time on day 6 is I don't actually have any duct tape right now, which is really frustrating. So um, I'm going to have to try and earn some money today and get one of those, which will be good. And I don't know if you noticed it when I opened my desk before, but I do actually have uh, a file. I might even have two, as long as the one that I put in my next door neighbor's desk isn't actually, um, hasn't disappeared. Because then I would actually have some flimsy cuts, which would get me through that fence a hell of a lot quicker. But to be honest, knives worked perfectly fine last time for the fence. So I'm not going to get, you know, too upset or too up in arms about that. All right, 16%, uh, 12%. Come on, and there you go, that's the fork gone. That should be enough for now, shouldn't it? That should be all right. So as long as I, oh, over the top, as long as I bring a fork with me, there you go. Uh, I can obviously st stock up on knives for tonight, because I can obviously jump out this evening and go and grab what I wanted, so that'll be good. Um, what are we going to do for the rest of the day? Because I even raised some of my stats during this time as well. What about speed? Should we get some speed up? Oh, no, actually, you know what? Let's do jobs. Let's do jobs. So, uh, Fracture took his worms game from Ronald. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Because team, team 17 are the same people uh, that made worms. So it was Fracture that took it. Fracture, Fracture, Fracture. Here we go. Please tell me Fracture has worms in his desk. No, he doesn't. Bug at me. All right. So I probably could get a cracker out and I could sort that out. Although part of me does want to save the crackers for beating up guards. So maybe, that, maybe that's a better idea, actually. Uh, what job has Paul got for me? Hello, Paul. Officer Pierre. All right. I can do that. Uh, what else are we going to do? I guess I can check these desks, actually, because I've just remembered that I don't have a battery right now or even a, a wire. So <laughs> probably worth getting both of those before I go and steal myself um, before I go and steal myself the bulbs out of that drawer. No, that's just another file. Not what I needed. I was hoping that you would have some duct tape on you. Nope, bugger all in there. Let's continue desk checking. Uh, oh, another file and another cracker. Yes, I will take those. Thank you very much. There you go. Afternoon roll call. All right. Let's see who's getting checked. Fingers crossed it's not me. Because at the moment, I'm at capacity with my inventory. As in, like, my hotbar. And then I have this cracker and newly acquired file as well. Which will put me two over. I guess I can just chuck them in the toilet seeing as it's the middle of the day. James and Jesse. Yeah, perfect. Actually, uh, jobs. I paid Paul good money for a candle. He never delivered. Okay. And Jackson is all cr cracking off next shower block. Good. Those are two fairly easy jobs. All right, let's try and beat up Officer Pierre. I'm hoping that if I just use one of the, um... 
one of the crackers, then Pierre will just go down really quickly. I'll try and do it indoors as well, so I'm kind of out of sight of everything else. Oh, Paul! Yeah! Look at that! <laughs> Free upgrade! That'll do. Alright, cool. So we don't really need that file. We've already got a better weapon than that, haven't we? We've got a 4 out of 5 weapon. Uh, somebody in the last video was asking in the comments how you check that. Basically, to check the durability or, like, the strength of a weapon, you hold down shift whilst hovering over it, and that's how it brings up, like, you know, the 3 out of 5, 4 out of 5, whatever it might be. Officer Pierre is going to give out a lot of money, so that's why I kind of want to do that one. I've just got, I haven't got the foggiest where he is, though. I bet he's inside of the guards' quarters. So, ah, no, there he is. There he is. Okay. Officer Pierre. I need to get you when you're indoors. Ah, oh, you've gotten indoors, but the wrong kinds of indoors. God damn it. Don't go to bed. You're supposed to be working right now. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm wondering where I can get away with this. Maybe he's not one of the guards that does indoor duties. Come on. Maybe I'll just go for it. Oh, I don't know, because I'm going to be in the line of sight of the snipers, though. Come on. Go into the gym. I'd love it if you went in the gym. But hopefully not if that other guard's going to come in. Oh, for God's sake. Since when were you two so pally pally, huh? Oh, God. No, it's, it's all over. It's all over. It's not going to happen today. That's fine. Whatever. I didn't even want to do it anyway. Oh, now he's indoors. Oh, for God's sake. Are you going to go right in the corner? Yes. If you go right to the far corner... Oh, this might just work. I might just be out of sight for this. Oh, there you go. Good, 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 good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. We've got Paul's bar of chocolate. I've got a baton and a guard elf outfit. Wait, that's different to my normal outfit. Do I want that instead of a, a guard? Like, I mean, I, oh, I don't know. I feel like I'd look more the part in that. Yeah, why not balls to it? Let's take it. Sure, why not? Hey, up. I'll swap it out for my other guard outfit. Did I just jump over that table? I didn't even know that was a thing. <laughs> That's really cool. Oh, no, 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 to Pierre. Get away. Bugger off. He's only hit me for one as well. Oh, is that? No, that's seven. That's seven. Oh, yeah. If he hits me again like that, then I probably am going to be in trouble. There you go. All right. So let's take out that guard outfit. And we're going to put the old guard outfit in, like, my neighbor's desk. That makes sense, right? There you go. All right. Holidays are coming. Music is kicked in. There you go. So what do I look like in this? I want to ch check this out real quick. Ah, oh, I look basically exactly the same. Never mind. But at least I know in myself that it's an elf guard outfit. So it feels more official. Oh, there you go. In you up. All right, what do you mean get going, buddy? You've not even gotten dressed yet. Yeah, you bugger off. Trying to talk to me like I'm not ready to work out in the gym. You're the one who's already, like, had a workout. You sweated it off. And now you're washing your clothes. Oh, there's a little scrappage in the middle. What you got on you? Oh, the heavenly duct tape. Yes. And then the guards have run off as well. Perfect. All right, duct tape from you. Thank you very much. Uh, I don't need anything from you. So what we're going to make with that first one is I think we're going to make some... I say some. We're going to make a poster, I believe. I mean, that's going to be the best thing for me. So I can start chipping through the back of my uh, cell and we'll be able to start working on that. Oh, God. I need to get ahead of the guards. I'm way too close to them right now. Bloody hell. Yeah, I've jumped up quite a few slots there. Not a fan. Oh, is it kicking off in shower block? Oh, it is. Um... Ah, oh, sugar. My rating's a bit too high at the minute, I think. Yeah, oh, no, that's good, that's good, that's good. 74% is fine, just as long as I lose the guards and another guard doesn't spot me and doesn't flag me up to 90. Yes, there you go. Right, just managed to get away. I've got 100 books right now as well, which is amazing. So, grab the magazine out. We're going to make you into a poster. There you go. There you are. Uh, now, did I chip through that wall? No, I didn't. Okay, I need to get to work on that. That's probably going to mean that I'm not going to be able to do what I did last time until day 7, rather than the evening of day 6, so that's a bit of a shame. Alright, I'm all out. I'm all out. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yes, yeah, so there's 7 naughty items in here at the minute. Um, candy cane leather. I'm wondering whether I need to bother with the candy cane leather at the minute, as in like having it on my person. Because that's going to be the last part of the puzzle, but already... I've already chipped through the wall in the gym to get another one, so I'm kind of undecided at the moment. Hmm, I cannot decide. I think what I'm going to try and do for now, though, is at least chip through this wall and get cracking on the back of my room. If I get this down before evening, uh, like the evening period ends, this will be really, really good. Come on. Oh, I tell you what I do need. I need my poster, and then I can just drop that. There you go. Come on, come on, come on. I reckon I can do this in time, just as long as I get enough sleep. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Although maybe it'll be good to actually save the day because at least then I'll have that as a backup. Ooh, I'm undecided. I feel like we've made some really good progress today. I feel like I'm in a really strong position right now in order to get the bulbs without getting caught. So maybe I'm not going to risk it. 
I don't think I want that biscuit that badly. Good. All right, poster is on the back of the wall. Uh, <laughs> the wall block needs to go somewhere. I'm coughing up a lung here. Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> dear, I need to rush. So uh, I can basically just drop all of these things here, here, and here. Because it might not be me. That's getting checked. Oh, God. Here we go. Up oh, we go, up we go, up we go. We need to get there in time so I can see it. Who's getting checked today? More, the following morons. Oh, not me. Yay. Okay. Well, maybe I will then. Maybe I'll go for it. So let me go and grab every knife and fork that I can see. And we'll make this happen. All right. There we go. That's, that should be enough. I think I should have enough forks to get through the wall. I've got my guard outfit and everything else looks groovy. I'm happy with this. And then it will mean in tomorrow's episode I can get a battery and I can finally track down where the last chest is. All right. So we're going to wait for the cells to lock. Come on. Lock the cells, lock the cells, ring the jingle bells in the holly halls for all of yours. Don't know why I went Zelda there. <laughs> Apparently that's where my mind was at. Everybody in? There we go. All right, cool. So everybody's in bed. Everybody's everybody's snug and tight. So I'm going to need to take these knives with me as well as probably a singular fork. So how, what percentage is that? Got 25%. Probably don't want that one. 100%. That's what we want. Okay. Oh, no, but we do need another poster. Unless I'm bringing enough forks where I can just cover the wall back up. Oh, I didn't think about that. So I think I'll leave it there for today because, you know, there's no point in risking another big fail. Although it can't get much worse because we're already in jail. Tomorrow we'll make poster number two, then make our bulb run and our dreams come true. Good night, everybody.